still smell her. Mark Nash, Michael Cross, Michael Cross, the boss. Yes, sir, Michael Gross, the boss, man. Yo, 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 yo. It's your boy, and I'm back with another one, man. I got some shocking, uh, I got some some news that I didn't think I'd see. We got Earl Spence Jr. supporting Kell Brook. Yeah, we got Earl Spence Jr. out here supporting Kell Brook. Earl Spence took to his verified Twitter account early, early this morning. And uh, he replied on a post that Kell Brook had put up in regards to the Conor Ben fight. Now, if you guys remember in the past, Earl Spence fought Kell Brook and captured his first world title at 148 pounds, the IBF. Also, if you remember, after Conor Ben, after the, the WBC cleared him he went after earl spence jr saying you the one who had a lot to say what you gotta say now why don't you fight me i would gladly knock you out in so many words now earl spence jr you know what i'm saying replied to colonel ben now he's replying to a post that kel brook put up regarding a Conor ben fight Let's go out to the uh, verified Twitter page real quick. So this is Earl Spence Jr.'s verified Twitter page. And as you can see, and let's go down. Kel Brooks said, and this re is replying to Connor Ben. Connor Ben tells Kel Brooks, stop talking shit. You know the footage begs to differ. Then Kel Brooks says, well, shit, if you got footage, put it out there. Then let's see it and don't just put snippets out. We want it all, baby. <laughs> no, I got that little funny ass accent, baby. Then Earl Spence Jr. replies to that tweet and says, Kale, beat that wanker ass. And we all know wanker is a is, is British slang. Uh, for I guess I don't fucking know what what Winker even means. Beat that, beat that guy ass. And then at the end of his tweet, he puts a syringe. And for those who don't know what a syringe is, it's a needle where you go to the doctor and you get a shot. And most steroid users put that syringe in their ass. Just being real with you, that's that's what I heard. I don't, I'm not I'm not a steroid user. I'm just going off what I hear. They poke you in the ass with that damn syringe to give you that boost. That is what Earl Spence Jr. had to say in regards to Carol Brook fighting Connor Ben. Now look, man, I'm with Earl. I'm I'm with Earl on this one. I hope Carol Brook goes out there, and if the fight does happen, I hope Carol Brook whoops. Connor Ben's ass. He needs to be held accountable for what he's done. He needs to be held accountable for what he's done. And who better to hold somebody accountable than their own countryman at 147? We've seen what Kell Brook just did to Amir Khan. And Earl responds to a, a uh, fan. He says, didn't you fight him coming off an audible surgery and coming down two weight classes to win his title? I fought after getting ejected from, the, from a car. They say was going high speeds in, in an eye surgery. Shh. So he's telling y'all, look, man, I fought after a wreck. Quit bringing up Kell Brook mood up weight classes. Quit, quit bringing up uh, uh, Gennady Golovkin broke Kell Brook out. I had an eye break. I got through from a car and I fought Danny Garcia. I had an eye break and I fought Ugas. So quit making excuses for why I beat Kell Brook. And he was just responding to a fan. But in all, he supports Kell Brook in his fight against Conor Ben if it, if it ever happens. So let's see, man. Let's see. Can Eddie, can Eddie pay Kell Brook enough? to get in the ring with Conor Ben. It should be a massive fight, a big fight for the UK. And uh, let's see how it plays out. 
Uh, you guys already know, man, I'm going to be dropping videos all day. We have reached that 4,000 total, and that just gave me some energy to put out more content. So please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Peace. Just remember, this video has been edited by Michael on Sports. Please smash that thumbs up button, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Until next time.